Uh, hi everyone, welcome to my Metaverse series. In this episode, I'm going to be teaching you how to use the Google Vision um, log logic, boxes, logic boxes to do a scavenger hunt of sorts. Uh, in this particular episode, we use the uh, person facial recognition logic box, and then we also use text. Uh, object is it's a little bit more complex than either of these two, so I'll likely devote an entire video to it. But for this one, I just wanted to uh, help those who are still having trouble with it. Now, the first thing that I like to do is uh, the first scene, I like to let the user know what they're doing. In this case, we're doing a scavenger hunt. So I even say, you know, I'll give them a hint, da 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 da. And then in the second scene, I actually commence the scavenger hunt and I start that by giving them the hint to the first thing which in this case I'm asking them to find the first president of the of America now in this one or in this scene it will lead to the first camera scene which I specifically have it as the rear facing camera you don't want someone to accidentally take a picture of themselves and then it leads over to person is found person is not found and it has two alternating paths if the person isn't found, it takes them to something that prompts them to try again, and it'll give them a hint. If the person is found, then it takes them to the next part of the scavenger hunt. In this case, it asks them to take a picture of the Constitution. Um, and with this, I, it was, I was having a little trouble uh, with the hint. I didn't want to put something that would just blatantly give the answer away, so I just simply prompted them to try again. Um... Because if you say, if you start saying which part of the Constitution, they could get the wrong search. Because in the is text, I only ask it to find the Constitution. So if someone puts in the first part of the Constitution, they'll get the preamble, and that could be wrong. Uh, it could, you know, not be registered. Uh, if you replace Constitution with, you know, you want the person to find a book cover, uh, you might have to really be specific because books have different uh, editions, and those different editions could say different things on the cover. Um, but then after they find the text, if they're correct, then it will take them to the ending of it, which it leads to an... Well, it ends there, and then it hints at another video that I'll likely make, and then if they miss it, then it takes them to try again. So now, with these uh, logic block boxes in place, let's try it out. Let's see if everything works. When I made this real short, I actually had more logic boxes, but some of them weren't working. So I decided to shorten it just to make sure that I really had the concept down. And so with face, what we're going to do is we're going to take up a picture of George Washington. And I believe that the Google Vision uh, facial recognition software is going to make sure it's him. I actually did take a picture of myself and it didn't work, so I'm not sure if it's... Excuse me, if it's that specific, but, you know, it, it actually didn't recognize myself. So now, with the Constitution, I pulled up this tab of the first part of the Constitution, which is the preamble. But I believe it's just looking for the word Constitution. Uh, and this should work, but I wouldn't be surprised if I had ran into some hiccups because I was running into quite a few earlier. Okay, no, so this one, this time it works. Uh, before it wasn't working before it kept sending me in a loop so you know be sure that your logic boxes are working that they're moving on from one team to the next um and don't just put it up there as is but other than that that is how you could do a scavenger hunt of sorts i'm really going to focus on object because people are likely going to want to use objects so i'm going to devote a whole video to that but at least we know how to use is person and is text. So thank you for your time and have a good day.